The Spot robot is finally all grown up and ready to leave the nest. That's right, Boston Dynamics is starting to lease out its four-legged dog-like robot to select early adopters for feedback and development. To celebrate this unique robot's coming of age, we wanted to relive some of Spot's most iconic moments and biggest milestones. Before there was Spot, there was Big Dog. This hulking robot was the world's first introduction to the four-legged creations of Boston Dynamics. In addition to carrying heavy loads and keeping its balance over rugged terrain, Big Dog also squealed in agony constantly as it struggled to get a grip in a world it never asked to be a part of. Sure, it looks like two people in a bad Halloween costume, but in reality it was designed to carry up to 340 pounds and run as fast as four miles per hour. Big Dog, however, did not make it out of boot camp. After being rejected by the military for being too loud, Big Dog retired to a beach somewhere, occasionally playing the bull in mock bullfights for the entertainment of its masters. It wasn't until 2015 that we met the original spot. Now this spot looks a little different than today's spot. Its first documented interaction with a human being appears to be this kick in the side of the head right here. The original spot is electrically powered, making it much quieter than Big Dog, though the hydraulics were still a bit loud. This spot made what appeared to be numerous attempts to escape the Boston Dynamics compound, but as far as we know, none were successful. After we met the original spot, we met the Spot Mini. The Spot Mini is small enough to maneuver around a person's home and is all electric without the need for hydraulics, making its suffering even quieter. The Spot Mini was also equipped with a nightmarish arm that looked like it could be its head. The arm allowed Spot to right itself after falls, do the dishes, and even bring its master a beverage, although that last part didn't go as planned. Perhaps the Spot Mini was just having some flashbacks. Holidays can be tough. In 2017, the Spot Mini finally got the iconic yellow casing that would make it a star. The Spot Mini's new blonde look helped give it the confidence to work together with other Spot Minis, autonomously navigate preset routes, and perhaps most importantly, boogie down. I gotta admit, as a child of the internet, I thought seeing a robot twerk wouldn't be a big deal until this moment, right here. Boom! If anyone from Boston Dynamics is watching this, I need to know who made Spot look back at it. I must know. Let's set up an interview or something, because I have so many questions. Call me. Anyway, just as Lil Bow Wow grew to be known simply as Bow Wow, the Spot Mini eventually dropped the Mini to become Spot. Spot went on to show the world it could work as part of a team, and it could work individually. The next natural step was to let our four-legged friend leave the nest and try to fly. Boston Dynamics is leasing out a limited number of spot robots for an undisclosed amount of money, which they say will cost less than a car. The target audience for spot seems to be industrial clients for now, who might use spot to monitor progress on construction projects and conduct safety inspections. Spot sure has come a long way from slipping on banana peels and being kicked in the head. How would you use a spot robot? Let us know your thoughts and favorite spot memories down in the comments. As always, thanks so much for watching. I'm your host, Jesse Orl. See you next time, what the fam.